In a developing story, former President Donald Trump's lies on immigration have escalated this week, and now they're putting real people in danger. We've been following this story closely after Trump spread debunked conspiracy that Haitian immigrants in Springfield, Ohio, are stealing pets and eating them. Now, despite absolutely there being no proof of such a thing happening, officials even coming out saying there's, there's no such thing happening either. Meantime, Trump and his running mate continue to spread this dangerous lie. Now this fake story causing real harm to real people. Take a look. As the scaring amplifies, I do believe more people will be violent. And that's why we have to stop this now. Concern is mounting over the potential impact of falsehoods spread by former President Donald Trump and others about Haitian immigrants in Springfield, Ohio including a debunked rumor that they are eating people's pets. It creates a lot of fear and, um, and confusion um, amongst the, 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 the Haitian community. A bomb threat Thursday forced Springfield City Hall to close, and officials evacuated two elementary schools Friday, according to the school district. I'm angry about the same day Trump doubled down on his controversial statements about the city's Haitian community. And I'm angry about illegal Haitian migrants taking over Springfield, Ohio. You see that mess, don't you? Local Same officials have debunked the false claims about Haitian immigrants uh, eating pets. These rumors are just, they're just not true. You know, Springfield is a beautiful place and your pets are safe in Springfield. The issue has gained enough attention to drive a strong White House response and engagement from federal officials. Spreading this type of hateful uh, conspiracy theories is indeed very dangerous. DHS has been directly engaged with the city of Springfield and local officials to make sure they have uh, the support they need. I'm Reed Binion reporting.